So after three months separation, we arrived back at our van, the little tough guy. We stored it with Laura and Christian and were very grateful that they took such good care of our home on wheels. And so starts another episode of our South American adventure. Thank you very much for our Patreons for making these videos possible. It's your support that assists us in making better videos. If you would like to support us, please go to patreon.com forward slash feelers on four wheels and subscribe today. The sun smells good. Let's see if there's oil dropping. We were all excited to be reunited as it was like unwrapping a big Christmas present as we took off the netting and inspected our house on wheels. It was in perfect condition as Christian has been starting it every few weeks for us. We also had none of the mold problems that we had in Tanzania, which was the last time that we stored a vehicle. And it starts first time, every time, like a jam. First connecting the battery to the system. And we've got light already working. Now we just need to connect the panels up to the controller and then um, our power. Made. So now we must just get the. Have a look what the screwdriver we need there for the. Where is it? There in the corner there. Can I go? Yeah. Where you disconnected it. Can I go? Anything is in place. Where did I disconnect it? Easel. On the black box? A plain, plain, gewone. A flat. While we're visiting Laura and Christian, we have an opportunity for some home improvements. So today's task is to replace this tap that's been leaking and irritating us because it's on a, a pressure pump and if it leaks, the pump keeps going. So we're going to take this one out. We've managed to get it loose. It's been connected with this and a very sort of homemade jobby of a plastic connector which I've now managed to break off and we're going to replace it with this one a brand new tap we bought a while ago and we've now got the opportunity to do the work so um, borrowed some tools from Christian um, which is great so we have a little bit more tools to work with and um, yeah, let's see how it goes. I might need to buy a new connector, but luckily there's a hardware store, a ferreteria quite close by. And I've got a sample now, but I first want to clean this out and see um, if it's the right size. Yeah, wish me luck. So while we're here at uh, Laura and uh, Christian's place, there was a workshop right next door and we decided to get our swivel tire moved from the roof to the, that's Christian, our favorite friend. <laughs> and we've decided to get the spare tire moved from the roof to the, to the car where it originally should be because it should improve um, petrol and usage and to streamline the car and hopefully um, improve the road holding and have less stuff on the roof. Then we don't need to get up to get the tires um, from the roof if we ever get a flat, which hasn't happened yet, cross thumbs. Yeah, so um, the work's done. We just have to have a look. Yeah. <laughs> I had a movie, yeah. One more time. Oh my gosh, 
Ah, perfect! Okay, we're going to have to say Then it was time to say goodbye. And hasta luego. See you later. Go, go, go. We also taught him a few South African phrases. Yeah. Come on, come on. Okay. Yeah. Ciao. See you in Iguazu. I hope so. Oh, that was a great visit. We have learned so much from these guys. Hopefully we've taught them a little bit. Bye! Ciao! Ciao! This is the way. Okay, and now we are off to Javier and... Miriam. Javier and Miriam at Cinco de Mayo, 25 of May. Another small town from what we've heard. And we're going to spend a few days with them. Ciao. There, there goes. There you go, Cecil, the mechanic, and Marcella, the maker of empanadas and um, the um, car washer extraordinaire. She um, washed our car twice and um, she has probably washed it the best that anybody's ever washed it. Tabatini wants to drive. Oh. Tabatini is in the, He's in, the in, festival. in the need for speed. He hasn't um, done such a long trip in a while. He's going to do a whole 130 k's today. Just come back from a brisk walk through Bentisinko de Mayo, 25 of May, a small town. We were visiting our friends, Miriam and Javier. Never did 7Ks walk, but it was a nice, easy surface. Visited the parks, saw some very interesting, very old trees and a very beautiful Catholic cathedral. Haven't been in a church in a while. Uh, my first church in a while, but yeah. Quite nice exploring a small rural Argentinian town. Morning, I'm feeling a bit like a Land Rover driver lying under the car, just inspecting our um, new um, spare wheel arrangement. Um, just checking if it lasts, and I need to put a, uh, I, and I need to put a lock on um, to just make it a bit more difficult to for the tire get stolen. Because currently you can only undo this nut and the tire comes loose. Yeah, just um, trying to make it um, a bit more difficult. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, it seems to last. I'm a bit worried about the the height, but it is lower, uh, higher than the back axle, so yeah, it should work all right. A little fast, let's get a cake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. This um, keeps the um, scallops, the criminals away, makes it um, not worth their while to try and steal our tire. Oh! Barbaros! Ciao, 
Ciao. Another great visit with our friends Miriam and Javed. Yeah, yes, she was really in tears when we left. Yeah. Eh? yeah, the people are so hospitable. It's um, quite, quite intense. Um, intense to um, translate all the time, but well, actually it's worth it. Yeah, and interesting last night at the Asado, at the barbecue, um, as the night went on, people started relaxing more and the conversation actually flowed a bit better. We could even understand quite complicated jokes on the car, on the way back in the car. Yeah, so uh, we just have to keep at it. But we're thankful for a few days on our own. I think if you do it too long, it'll become very stressful. Yeah. I think you'll be right. I was going to eat it. Okay, so now we are heading back um, to Buenos Aires and then we're heading to the north to explore the northern provinces of Argentina, Iguazu Falls is coming our way and uh, some of the, a few of the beaten track things. But that's a story for another time, so please remember to like, subscribe and hit that bell icon so you won't miss out on future adventures. Thank you for our Patreons for making these videos possible.